Hello and welcome back to my let's play on Shogun 2 with the Shumazu on Legendary Difficulty. Well, last time I left off, we had a pretty big, decisive battle waiting for us. If we beat these Shoni back now, we should be able to run for other territories with no roll. Not well, there will be some resistance, but not a lot of it. This is definitely the um, the deciding point in the camp. Or well, yeah, I did say campaign, didn't I, last time? Uh, anyway, they certainly have a better army than us. They have uh, seven archers against my two. Uh, four of those are both samurai against my one. Um, they have a lot more Yari Ashigaru. In fact, they have a total of 11 units. Whereas, actually, we have more than that, don't we? We have... Um, what is this? Seven... We have, we have 11 also. <laughs> uh, but we have a samurai retainer. We have two katana samurai. So really, in the infantry front, we're beating them quite uh, nicely. They have some more experience, we have some uh, improved uh, melee attack. Um, yeah, overall it's gonna be um, it's gonna be an interesting battle. It's it's It kind of depends on the castle, I guess. Let's find out what the castle is. Ooh, it's... Uh, I think that's a rather small castle, unfortunately. A, a larger castle would have been preferable here because, of course, uh, one of the main tactics we can use here, which is a bit of an exploit, but... Um, is to move, like basically park our entire army in the back, make all of them climb up, including their archers, and then get into position as the archers are climbing up. Because the archers are always at the front, usually, anyway. I say always, and then usually immediately in the same sentence. They're usually up front. Um, they're very upfront about it. But yeah, if we could do that, that'd be great. But it seems unlikely. It is raining. That's fine. I don't... Actually, I think that's probably a, a good thing, if anything. Um, right, so yeah, there, there is a chance. It, it completely depends on where the enemy is going to come from, though. And I imagine... They're probably going to come from every single side, which means their arch is going to be split on different locations. Like, if we could make even a couple of them climb up, it'd be really beneficial to us. So, I am for the moment going to... Oh, uh, that's never going to work. I'm going to keep all of this... I'm going to have to do smaller portions again. Four? Uh, I guess that'll do. It's not fantastic, but there you go. Um, yeah, just park all these units back here. In fact, I'll keep the arches up here for now. Park you in there. The two generals need to be parked in there. You guys need... To... Oh, I have another archer, of course. I have two archers. <laughs> All right, then. We're fine. Uh, yeah, so if, if for some reason the entire army came from there, that'd be great. Because then this tactic would work perfectly. But it's unlikely that's going to happen. I imagine there's going to be a couple archers over here. Maybe a couple archers over here. Maybe a couple over here. I don't know. If we can make one or two of the groups climb up, or if we can just have like half of them climb up, basically. If I could have all the both samurai climb up, that'd be fantastic. Uh, I will keep you guys here just in case I don't go through with this plan. I can just imme I, I'm in position right away to start firing back. If otherwise, I'll just run them back anyway. Uh, so yeah, I think that's, that's about all I've got to be honest. Let's find out where they all are. So they are fully split. That's Bobo Bobo. Oh, that's a thing of beauty. That that's an absolute thing of beauty. All right, I'm gonna put you guys on the wall here. Run. I'll put you over there for now. They, I think I missed one archer. Let's see where. Yeah, there's one archer over there. That's fine. Uh, so now I need to make sure this stuff is really away from them. I, I don't know if this castle is even large enough for, for this to work, but if it... Oh, it could be beautiful. I may have to stack them all individually, to be honest. Just to make sure we absolutely take up as little space as possible. Which this is, you know, kind of disgusting exploit-wise, but there you go. Suck it. Uh, not you. You can stay where you are. Generals, you might want to join in on the on the fun too. There's a party going on over here. I think this unit was the one that's a bit, yeah. All right, this is gonna be uh, quick and dirty. This one, I'm afraid. Looks like uh, everyone's running up real fast, so that's okay. The moment these guys start climbing, we can get into position. Oh fuck, I forgot about the katanas. Quickly, you're ruining everything because they they're thinking they're seeing they're they're seeing that unit. They're like, oh, we could shoot at those. I may have to sacrifice my archers. I don't care too much about this bow samurai anyway, for being honest. I sh I'm going to grab a couple of these so I can start running into position. Most of them are already climbing, given the given the order to climb anyway. Nothing's really on the walls yet, but the walls are very small, so... Alright, I think that one's going to have to just be able to fire at me. I need to get in position now. This is not enough. Um, uh, okay, we got the katanas, of course. I'm gonna try and save you guys. There's no need to throw you away just like that. All willy-nilly and all that. Uh, just keep you guys over here. Oh, don't tell me they stopped the climb. Oh, it could be that they're bugged out. I mean, that if in that case, I'll be bugged out as well, which is not great. Okay, we got a unit firing. The rest is gonna continue climbing. That's perfect. Okay, everyone's in Yari Wall. Just to make sure I line them up more nicely. 
but that's okay. Ugh, okay, we got units coming in now. Coming in hot. Oh, God, the generals! Get the fuck out of there, dude. Uh, you can stay over here. You get over there. Katana, help out over here. Small archer, you know what? In fact, why don't you just go down and kill them? Uh, yes, don't, uh, don't, don't do that. Don't get caught fighting. We don't want that. Archers, yes, it's time for you guys to get off the wall. I kind of forgot about you. But that's okay. You are not in the position that I want you in at all. So far, so okay, though. Yeah, you guys are just gonna go down. We need to kill that unit. It's the only one that's actually firing at me right now. I don't think we're gonna need you, so I'm gonna pull... Oh, no, we got this. We got the sword of that. It's alright. It's all good. Cool. Now, it's basically, uh, just waiting until we win, really. I think I may have run down a little bit too quickly. These guys are gonna turn around and just start firing at me now. That would not be preferential. Preferred? Just preferred, I think. It's correct. There is still an archer outside. I kind of forgot about them, but that's okay. We can probably just fire at them a little bit. Samurai retainers, get the fuck in there. Just kill shit, but don't kill shit that's outside, so... Uh, actually, I don't know. These are all Ashigaru, so we'll probably be okay. I'm gonna help out with the general, though. Maybe to both of them. Why not? You're no longer necessary here. Why don't you go over there, actually? Stay in Yari Wall. Okay, I probably should keep a general inside for morale buffs, but... It's too late now! Here we go, boys! Actually, why don't you try and... Can we charge them? Yeah, that'd be great, because we might be able to just route them. Any route anywhere basically causes a, uh, a mass route to happen pretty quickly. Let's get in there, because we need help. Where's my other katana? There you are. I want to help out these two units holding the corner. Okay, routed that first unit, and the second one's about to go as well. Uh, you have routed a unit as well. And that, again, like I said, is causing everything else to route too. Need to be careful the generals. It looks like we, they might charge around and go towards my generals, so I'm going to keep you outside just in case. In fact, you can start blockading this off, because everyone's going to run through here eventually. Yeah, that, they, they certainly look like they might be on their way. They might just go for the corner, they might just dismount right here. But I'm not sure. Yeah, they are dismounting. Okay, so you can stay outside. You're going to go over here, because a lot of shit's going to run over here as well at some point in the future. Uh, you're taking a little bit too much damage, unfortunately. I did say I was going to have to probably give up some units here, but honestly, it's looking like... It'll be better than I expected in reality, in the end. Although, I would really like everyone to just fucking die already. Um, get in there. Yeah, we uh, we need to start flanking a little bit. That's what I need to do. I'm putting them out of Yari Wall, which is not fantastic. You guys are going to go outside, because eventually stuff's going to route here as well. Oh, there's two entrances. That's okay. Just go somewhere, because by the time we arrive, all this shit's going to route anyway. We have seen Yari Ashigaru and a general. Oh, one of the generals is actually, actually on his way. Okay, let's go hunt him down. That doesn't mean I want a different unit down there. So let's, uh, let's take one of these Yari Ashigarus. Put him over here. Kill everything that's running, basically. we got units coming towards us here, too, so let's get you out of here for now. This will probably mass route in a minute, but I don't, you know, want to have an oversight and just miss out on two units there. So yeah, two two of my units are gonna die. Well, not maybe not die. They'll probably survive, but I'm gonna try and pull you out of there. It's gonna lose me a lot of men trying to pull them out, but I should have enough men in there to kind of cover me as well. They're wavering. I think they're gonna route. There you go. They've routed, and I think that is it. And we got these guys outside, basically just in time. Maybe just a little bit too late, but we got more generals. My lord! A glorious victory will soon be yours! There is a general unit right here. Did we actually end up... Yeah, we hunted him down. Um, how many actual the general men are still alive? Five. I see one right there. And I see four over here, including the fucking general. Alright, someone needs to go murder that man. Where's my cat, boys? Uh, you're in here somewhere, right? There you are. Just run this way. I need you to kill... What the fuck? One of them is over here. How the hell did he get over there when the rest is still in there? That's impressive. Uh, General. Go kill that unit. Uh, you've killed everything here that may have... I don't think much actually ran this way. Oh, there's still... That one general man right there just died. So the rest is up to the generals to murder. Don't go after that one guy that was over there. 
Actually, no, he, he's the one who just died, so yeah, just kill the general, that'd be great. You need to catch up to this shizzle. There's probably gonna be some stuff that gets away, but hey, that's just more experience. So yeah, in the end, uh, two units down to 6651, the rest is all pretty pretty good. Uh, that was better than I expected, I'm not gonna lie. I think having six archers come from one side was super beneficial. If that hadn't happened, we would have taken a ton more damage, just arranged. Let's run up to the front first. Did you kill the general yet? Uh, there he is, the final man of this unit. My lord, there he goes. Their general has fallen. So I'm out ducking and weaving through my men. Blow. Did he get decapitated there in the end as well? Oh, certainly looks like he, he didn't actually. I, thought, I was looking at his legs and I thought that was his head missing. I was like, yep, he did. No way, he didn't. Uh, I could triple speed the rest of this. Not really all else I can do. Let's just get over here. But uh, but uh, but uh, but uh. Oh shit, Absolute there's way more over here. Rest. Get them all. Kill them. Kill them. Alright, I don't know what else there is. Oh fuck me, I thought it was a huge unit over there. It was just a calf. Close victory? I'm sorry. What the fuck else do you want from me? How is that close, game? Please, explain that math to me. Uh, I'll be waiting. Ridiculous. Close victory. The fuck out of here. Nonsense. I want to see the stats, actually. It's, uh... It's not close, I'll tell you. Or it wasn't. Come on, loading screen. I'm trying to hide the fucking stats from me, because you know you're wrong, eh? I know what's going on here. You're delaying the inevitable. I'm gonna prove to you right now. Look at that. Look at that. They arrive with... 3,000 men have 100 men remaining. I arrive with 3,000 men have 2,000 remaining. Yet you dare call this close. How the fuck was that close? Huh? A little shit? Anyway. Um, plenty of experience gained. There's only four units that are still inexperienced. This one somehow leveled up, whereas that one didn't. I guess because it has more men remaining? I don't know. Maybe they had some experience from a previous battle, but I seriously doubt that, because I don't think this army has had any battles yet. Katana Samurai proving why they're in the army this early on. Uh, yep, good shit. Oh, it looks like they survived with like the tiniest thing. That's perfect. That's just like 10 extra experience for me right there. Very nice. And we leveled up as well, which is very nice, again. All right. All right. All right. All right. Cool. Uh, oh, good. Yeah, we didn't get sabotaged. Thank fuck. What was he trying to do then? Nothing. But he's just sitting there for fun then. Okay. That's what you want to go for. That's, that's the excuse you're using. Fine by me. Uh, let's see. Plus... Oh, I love that. Oh, I love that too. Jeez. Oof. Oh, that's a tough choice, that. I did not think I was going to have to make such a dis difficult decision. Oh, man. Okay. That is just... I mean, what was the other one we got? Because he's got, like, crazy archery as well. I think he had plus 10 accuracy. Yeah, so he has plus 10 accuracy. This guy's got plus 5%, which is not as good. Because, uh, I mean, let's take the best archer unit in the game. The bow... Warrior monks. Sorry, I got an email. Uh, the bow warrior monks. I mean, there's the Daiki Samurai too. But yeah, anyway, the point being, they have 60 accuracy, so an extra 10% would be 6. Oh, uh, sorry, 5% would be 3. God, that sounds... That's that's so much worse than I... <laughs> I don't know if that takes into consideration buffs you get, though. Because obviously with the craftsman, you ex add an extra 10, so it'd become 3.5, I guess. Um, I gotta say, though, either way... Plus 5%. It's not bad, but I fucking love extra movement range, so I'm gonna go for that. Uh, yeah, normally I'd go for the buff of the the units, but I mean seven per or five percent, and on like even on the best units, that still only adds like three. You know, that's just not really all that exciting, is it? Uh, right, I must have had a plan for keeping this place happy. Recruiting units is certainly not the answer because I have no fucking money and I'm losing. I'm actually how what. The we're gonna die. Um, yeah, that's a good thing, or a good question. What the fuck are we doing with money here? Can anyone... Oh yeah, no one wants to trade in this campaign. I remember now. Someone commented that it's because I had a Nanban trade port, and that, like, seeps Christian religion. 
I don't know if that's true. I don't think so. I've never seen that happen before. Don't think trading with someone who has a Naman trade port gives you Christianity. Uh, but either way, I already got rid of it and they still don't want to trade with me, so... Uh, now we could we could merge some units, I guess. Like the these two especially are pretty fucked up, so I wouldn't mind merging. But it, I mean, well, I guess we're gonna take Sukushi. So, oh right, no, I, I remember we were gonna exempt this place. We were gonna unexempt Bungo. For now, which uh, yeah, that's not gonna get any less happy. That's still not helped though because the income on those places is almost identical, but it's actually slightly better in Busan. But we're gonna take Sukushi and possibly Hizen as well. Because we know they have a bit of an army, but it's not here. Oh, we're noted. Or, of course, still busted. Uh, I actually got, I think, Wretched Egg commented that I should probably turn off all my mods and then turn them back on again. Have you tried turning it off? Oh, fuck, I messed up the quote. Have you tried turning it off and on again? Um, no, you fucked up and I went to the wrong building again, you piece of garbage. That has actually shaved off a, uh, it shaves off a turn of heaven and earth. But, no, I want to get my Metsuke as soon as possible. Get the fuck out of here. Um, anyway, yeah, so they, uh, they they said that I should turn off all, or uh, unsubscribe from all the mods and then resubscribe. Probably not a bad idea. This was like multiple videos ago, though. I probably will do at some point. Ah, yes, here we go. More money. Okay, now we're, we're doing okay. Yet I still can't recruit a unit in Buzin because we simply have not got the money. This is going to go up to, like, minus 7, although it's going to go down maybe minus 6 by the time that gets there. This is going to keep going down probably until 0, so we, we should be able to keep it exempted, unexempted, exempted, unexempted, etc. etc. Um, what, uh, what experience are you at? Just the one. Okay. You're the guy who's on uh, 10 experience, aren't you? I totally forgot I have quite a lot. Well, not a, I was going to say a decent force. I don't have a decent force, but I have some units here. So yeah, this place is actually getting happier, so I could technically get rid of units in to increase my income, so I don't have to, um, well, yeah, but the point being, I have to keep exempting it all, all, all the time as well, so that's not great either. Anyway, Tsukushi, uh, minus two, we're gonna gain, oh, fuck me, this is, okay, I'm only minus one, though. We're gonna gain four, five, six, and then... Minus one again, so we're gonna gain five. This is not gonna we could probably exempt it I'm not gonna even do math because I'm sure we'll be fine Oh, hello, Mr. Metsuki All right, I mean we could run back and forth here as well if we needed to oh look at this fucking town. Holy shit uh, We don't want a yard. Uh, oops. We don't want a yard jewel yard or a bow, uh, An archery dozer here then. I guess we'll take uh, I mean obviously the sake then and I guess we'll take a uh, Buddhist temple as well so I can start working on that Christianity. 748 income from here. What? That's incredible wealth. What the fuck? I mean, we got very fertile soil. Oh, we got a mil They fucking built a military port already. Holy shit. <laughs> what the fuck? I've gained no other resources, though, so I imagine trade is still not going to be likely. Once I acquire the war horses, things are going to be looking up for me. I'll tell you right now. Okay. Uh, I'm sure they'd want a piece out by now as well. Surely. Yeah, but fuck you. I... Can't. You know what? I, just out of curiosity, would you uh, would you peace out and then trade with me as well? They would. I do not. That's how poor they feel about this whole situation. Right. Anyway, I'm gonna keep grinding the experience on the main guy. I think I might still merge. No, I'm not gonna merge because I'm gonna stay in my own territory. So they're both gonna replenish this turn. We do have another battle, perhaps, waiting for us. But after that last battle, I'm sure we could take him. We're not going to be able to reach Higo in a single turn. Uh, I mean, they may... Hopefully they come and attack me, but they might just run back in, into Higo. And we'll actually probably have to attack with both our forces, but that's okay. Uh, this place will at least be happy, so I can move on next turn. That's great. So I have two markets as well. I'll have to build some more, but that means I can have at least... Um, I can have at least two Metsuke already. The Gambling Hall, of course, is going to get removed. I talked about that last time, too, but I can't right now because I need the happiness. The happiness. Uh, other than that, we have no markets. Higo's definitely going to have a market as well, so that'll be free, but I'll need to make two more. I'm not sure where we're going to build those, but... I mean, these early towns like Hyuga, we don't need the plus two happiness from the culture, so we can actually Enosumi as well. We can remove those two Sake Dens and rebuild markets if we wanted to. 
Our income has flown up since last turn, or since the beginning of this turn, in fact. We were losing like 200 bucks per turn, and now we're gaining 1,302. Uh, and it, once we uh, we can unexempt Boozen, obviously we'll make a lot more, but then we have to exempt Bungo again, so... Anyway, this ship I'm gonna keep here for exploration purposes. This could still fuck me, but since they're doing that right now, I imagine maybe they won't attack me. Maybe it's all just a bunch of trade ships, I don't know. Um, we are technically losing money, but I'm gonna use that little exploit to uh, just build some trade. Well, a trade ship, I actually. Actually, no, we got a military port here, fuck yeah. Oh, it's busted, never mind. Uh, got a trading port here, though. Uh, in fact, I might want to try and get there ASAP. I'm going to take the shittiest ship here that we have. Just send it up there, because I think the Shoni owned that. So if we kill the Shoni, we will uh, instantly gain a bunch of a bunch of moolah. Uh, because we can grab that right away. I don't know if they still own it, if someone else owns it, then whatever, but... Oh, that is that... Okay, they could definitely fuck me up. That, that, would, be a, that would be a really good final hurrah for them. Also, our income flew up to 1757. Was there a bug somehow with the fucking raw silk? Oh, wait. No, they were raiding me, right? And then this this just changed when I... When I moved the ship off. It changed course to here instead. Oh, that's funny. So, <laughs> they're no longer even raiding me. That's weird as fuck. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Um, I'm gonna... No, I'm not gonna move any ships over there yet. Because I need the money. You can sabotage. Oh, if this guy... This would be another great final hurrah for them if they kill off of one of my generals before... Before they die. That'd be really annoying. Um, I could get there next turn if I start moving right away. Yeah, Alright, let's just assume I can keep these places happy. I want to make sure I can get there right away. Even though, if this force goes back, we might not be able to take it, but I could do it the turn after. Okay! Good fucking sh... Oh, am I busting this thing down? Yeah, I am. Good. Uh, good, good, good. I mean, we could get a level 3 Metsuke already, but... Right. Or, uh, sorry, level 2, but I want level 3. Alright, Shoni, don't do not do anything stupid with your stupid, stupid, stupid navy, you stupid prick. Fuck you. He's, he's, he's doing something. Either an agent action or a an attack move. It was an agent action since we didn't see it happen. Oh, they're going back. No, you fucking cunt, your final hurrah! Alright, sail away. Far. I sail so far, I sail so far away, but not far enough. Son of a bitch. Well, there goes our trade navy, and all of a sudden our income is fucking dropped. I need to get a ship on there ASAP, because yeah, now other people are getting ideas, they're like, wait a second, that shit's open. It's free real estate. Assassination attempt, but he failed, thank fuck. Alright. Everyone's fucking angry. I'm gonna not make a lot of money this turn. Because I think I might have to exit. Oh, fuck! We can't keep this place happy at all! Son of a bitch! What about you? You can be fine. Okay, you're fine. We're gonna have to exit. I can't speak. That's how annoying this is to me. Um, I can't even get there either this turn. That is awful annoying, which means I can't kill him off, which means we can't grab this trade resource. Oh no. Okay. I mean, no one else is going to grab it this turn either. It's just, I need to make sure I can grab it next turn without, you know, without parking a ship here, because then they'll just attack me and murder me. I guess I can build a trade ship here. That would be enough, actually. And then you're still going to park there. Although, if there's a I guess this is fine now. Yeah, it is a Shoni. They're not gonna they're not gonna sail away and take me out, I think. But let's just hide over here. Maybe you won't see me. <laughs> um Right, you have to be exempted. Oh, our income is gonna be minus. That's not good at all. And you ca I can't well actually If I can't reach with this army or sorry, if I can't take it with this army, yeah, you need to go check this out. Oh, they're not inside. They'd probably be in reinforcement range though. Can I kill them? This army is fairly experienced, but it's also very small. But then again, you are very small. And they've got Yari Samurai as well. Oh, it would be rough. It's probably doable. But it would certainly be a rough battle. I really don't want to risk it, but if I can, if I can do it this turn, it would save me so much grief. 
Um, right, you're gonna start sailing over there now. Because then, then the thing is, well, actually no, because I need to keep, I need to keep units in here. Right, of course, I have that issue. I can't actually keep this place. Ha I, yeah, no, I, I can't. Because I, it'd be minus six, then exempt it, it'd be minus f uh, two. So I could recruit one unit, but that's still not enough. Plus, my income is horrendously low. So I'm gonna not exempt this place and actually just move units around. And we'll just have to move up with this army and take this next turn. Uh, ooh, this guy... Oh God, this guy might get ideas and attack me. And he probably would be able to reach as well. I can attack him right now. Oh my God, are they... Yeah, they're reinforcing rage. Okay. Oh my God, if they weren't... In... No, that would have... No, that wouldn't have worked. I was going to say, if they weren't in reinforcement range, that would have been great, because I could take it, but then their army survives because it's in their final town. So I would just have, like, two generals sitting there immediately die. So the thing is, he could definitely attack me, so I can't... I can't hold one of the... Unless I try and hold both of them, which I guess... Hold on, okay. Oh, God, the math. Right, so I want to put five units in here and then recruit one to keep this place happy. So let's do that first. So recruit one, put five in there. He's in needs three units. Um, but if I need five there, I'm put the most useless ones. Because I'm I'm assuming. Oh god, but I don't know. Do I? He could just he could just attack. Um, I, I'm assuming he's gonna attack Ezen, but he could just attack Sukushi instead, and then I'm just throwing away units here. Uh, okay, we're just gonna abandon. No, we can't abandon this one because it's gonna rebel. Son of a bitch! I need to. I need to exam. I need to. I need to abandon Heizen. That's what I need to do. God, if they take Heizen down, it's gonna be super annoying. But I'm just gonna have to deal with it. Maybe that. Maybe now that they see this army here, they won't. They won't. They won't uh, waste their waste their lives like that. Uh, you're gonna start heading over here as well, because, you know, if I can jump on that one, it'd be great. Uh, would you mind if I just uh, move on through, please? Thank you. Uh, oh, nice. Sun and Air's got lucky. I guess because he's the one who's been constantly attempted on assassination. Assassination? Uh, we're making fucking nothing in terms of income. Two places exempted, which have to be exempted. This place is almost actually okay, but it's not yet, so there you go. Uh, I could increase tax, but... Oh god, because if we lose Heizen, we actually... No, we don't go bankrupt because it's exempted right now. Okay, so that would be fine. We need to get this back. We lost, like, nine trade ships there, and that was a real fucking painful moment right there. I am building a new trade ship, so yeah, once we take out... If we can take out the Shonen next turn, which is likely that will happen. Unless they take Heizen, and then I won't be able to take it back immediately, which would be really annoying. Um, but yeah, either way. If we kill him on next turn, we can just grab that, grab that, and then I'll... We can start finally making our trade empire here. We're still playing 40 chess, man. It's ridiculous. Um, still can't get trade because I don't own the war horses yet. Might be able to come to agreement. Please. It's not going to work. And the Ouchie definitely want to kill me. Oh, God. This is the turn the Ouchie declare war on me, isn't it? I just feel it coming right now. I shouldn't have said it. I'll jinx myself. I know it. Ouchie, please. Don't Ouchie me. Oh, Metsuke is... No, wait, the ninja's doing something first. Come on, don't be a prick. Alright, that's good. Oh my god, they've got fucking light cap. Well, I guess that makes sense, it's here. Uh, we lost the general. Oh, it's not my son and heir, which is a good thing. But the bad thing is, I don't know if he's dead or wounded, and I won't know until next turn. That's very annoying. Um, god, that, that will be a nice little f final hurrah for them, which... You know, fair enough. If they if they killed one of my generals, he wasn't super important. It, it we, you know it it would suck, but it's like eh, that's that's fair. That's fair, Shoni. You did something. Uh, they're out archering me quite badly again, but we're defending. Should be good. They do some light calf, which is fuck me. I mean, I'm just thinking now in the Takeda campaign, have we ever fought any cavalry? I know I like obviously I used quite a bit of it, but I can't currently remember any battles where I actually fought enemy cavalry. I'm sure we have. Like, I, there's no way we haven't. I mean, besides generals, of course. Um, 
And the final episode you would have seen from that is, I think, episode 11, which is going up today for me. Uh, anyway, we got a lovely, lovely little hill here, which I'm gonna make great usage of. Uh, actually, yeah, you guys are not gonna be jo uh, used, so I'm just gonna park you in the back. And then we'll just get you guys all over here. Doesn't really matter. Actually, yeah, it, matters, it matters a slight bit to me. Let's do it like this. It's not like we have to run very far. Uh, I'm using this hill, by the way, because of course it's the best fucking hill. Uh, this one would be better, but it's outside of the map, so you know, sometimes you gotta make do with what you got. Park you guys over here. Right! Um, and of course, yeah, we, I won a forest because their archers definitely outnumber me. They could still sit back and shoot me, but I'm gonna park in such a way. This is too many units. I'm gonna park in such a way that. Oh God, let's do one less, actually. That they'll basically have to. Um, They'll, they'll have to move in here in order to see me. Because I'm just going to park my general back here somewhere. And the other units are going to all be hidden. Uh, and the, count, the katanas even. I might want to jump in too. Alright, and now we wait. Fuck me, I thought I was sitting there for a while. For, for a minute. I was like... You do know you're attacking, right? But I think they do. Right, uh, you're both hidden. Perfect. Let's spread you out a little bit further for the cavalry. You too. Oh shit, speaking of cavalry. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, you guys. I'll fire at will. They're gonna turn around the moment they see my units, unfortunately. But... Our hidden units have been what? My lord. Okay, hold on. There's a, new, there's a thing that I've just discovered, which uh, I, I think is a thing, but I didn't know it was a thing until just now. Um, I think light cavalry have a higher scouting ability than other units do. I don't know if that's a thing or not. Please let me know if it is or not. Um, but I, I mean, how the fuck else did they? Why are you? They're actually charging in. How the fuck else did they? Uh, did they scout my units from that far away? What are you doing? <laughs> I mean, I'll, I'll gladly take it. I would like to hide again before these guys arrive, though. Well, that was a very effective battle. Good job, guys. I hope you uh, come back so I can kill you again. Oh, that one's got an idea as well. That one's, that one's like, oh, I'm gonna take him from the flank. <laughs> Against the only unit that's still hidden. Oh, we're hiding again. Yori Ashigaru. Because Our I must... hidden units have been discovered, my lord! Yeah, I mean, these guys are fucking... They're scouting very far away. I think, I think maybe that is actually a thing. Uh, I also don't like the way they're approaching me here. It's not very straight. Uh, ah, whatever, we'll be fine. Okay, we're being shot at, so I think they are going to sit back and shoot. Let's pop you guys in the eyeball again. They, just, they didn't notice the... Uh... Oh, that one, sure, that's fine too. I'll put that one in the eyeball. They didn't notice the uh, corpses of all the other horses around there. We have absolutely no green men in there. Oh, I'm hearing more charges. That's good. Alright, let's just pop them all in Yari well before I fuck up. Yari amazing, Yari amazing. Alright, you guys can fire now. Not a bad idea. Uh, in general, you might as well move up because this whole, you know, trying to lure them into a false sense of security wasn't really uh, relevant in the end. You guys can cover flanks. Oh, they're coming in for round two. They actually survived round one. That's impressive. There's the other unit that didn't survive round one. Once again. Oh, no. I'm like, wait a second. Those are spear guys. That's why I put in that unit there. They're really like, oh, fuck. Where do we go, man? I mean, look at all these guys. They're all Yaris. They all have a spear. That's the thing we don't like, correct? Uh, yeah, I think so. I think that's the, that's the thing that we don't like uh, fighting, actually. Oh, let's try it anyway, because, you know, we're, uh... Just running around back and forth isn't really doing a whole lot either, is it? Oh, I guess you're right. Let's just charge in then, shall we? Oh, fuck, we've routed everything over here already. Uh, alright. I guess we'll take you guys out of Yari well, and just head up that way, I suppose. Yari... Uh, both Samurai will actually beat Yari Ashigaru one-on-one. -on -one. Like, no experience or anything. To... Change the odds. Uh, if you're not in Yari Ball, of course. If you're in Yari Ball, they don't stand a fucking Our chance. Great, my lord. 
Good. Living on the edge. That's where you're most successful. Alright, let's actually just run you up in the eye wall. Run the fuck in there! Just run into the units in Yariwal and you'll be okay. You're amazing, you're amazing. Uh, you're the really wounded unit. I wasn't really planning on using you. This general's awfully survivable. You're gonna charge me in the back? Alright, let's take my arm and turn him that way. Fucking see if I carry a little prick. Uh, Alright, you guys. Out of Yariwal. Fucking go. You guys go and general. Why don't you? Why don't you do something as well? But be careful. Be careful, my general. Well, I'm seeing a master out on the horizon. Oh, and they've seen a general on the horizon. They're coming for me. Like a lass. My lord. My lord. Glorious victory will soon right. be yours. Glorious. Gloriously victorious. Now, I don't have an extra general to run them down. This, this was their plan all along. They didn't want to kill my general, specifically. They just didn't want to be able to kill their army off. And I really would like to kill their army off, of course, because... Um, nice, no, that general's dead. Because, of course, we're about to take their town, and the less they have surviving, the better. But it's gonna all come down to this one general, my son and heir. My most valuable possession. <laughs> Fucking kill them all, General Man. You got it. Get in there. Slaughter them. Absolutely disgrace their families for putting such cowardly men onto the world. Okay. You get that one as well. I can never fucking double click it. There you go. Where's the rest? Yeah, that's all gone. Okay, that's the only unit I can do anything about. And this one. Come on, guys. You can do it. Go! Yeah, we're catching a couple of them. Oh, here we go. We're snagging him. <laughs> it's like tagging one every time. You're still killing shit. Oh, you actually did that quite successfully. Wow, just one guy remains. Good stuff, guys. Good work all around from all the chasers. I know you're tired as fuck and some must rest, but, you know, there it is. Let's get out of here. Heroic. That one was heroic. All right, the last one was close, but this one was heroic, was it? All right, game. That's enough nonsense from you. It's a bunch of baloney you're feeding me here. You know what would be cool? Is you would get more experience from a heroic victory. That would be that would be a cool little addition. Alright, hire me already, CA. I'll make Shogun free. Let's do it. Um I mean to be fair, that was definitely like numbers wise, that was better than the last one, sure. But the other one was also way more difficult than this. We were outnumbering how to f ah whatever. Anyway, good job. Uh, how did my katanas do? Eh. Eh. It's alright. Alright. We're gonna kill the fucking Shoni now. This is the best turn coming right up. Don't you fuck- Oh, they attacked the Shoni. That's very kind of you. Don't blockade. I don't think they- Oh, he's dead! Son of a- I mean, I- it, Yeah, like I said. K kudos to them, I guess, on their last hurrah. But that's still really annoying. I didn't need four generals this early on, though, so... Better him than my son there, I'll put it that way. Uh, blockade a port. Jesus. They don't own a port, unfortunately. I mean, that would be... I have a ship right here, that would have been fantastic. But I'm, I'm not going to be able to do that. Because, well, after this, I won't be at war of anyone. And I'll be right about now. Peacefully occupy that. Fucking die, Shoni. We've done it. We've secured Kyushu and the war horses, and now things are gonna start looking up in the world. I may not have to exempt you, because I can probably just run you in there. Bungo can be unexempted, and in fact can be... If I recruit one unit, it'll be fine. I can now grab this here. Oh, Iko Iki, get fucked, dude. Oh my goodness, that must feel so sad for you. It's just such a shame, I don't give a shit. Gosh, that's unfortunate for you, my man. Uh, yes, let's go all out on trade ships, although I have no money. But I might I might have a bunch of money in just a moment. Let's find out if people want to trade with me yet. Aha! Right, now I, how, I don't know how many trade... Um, oh my god, 832. I don't know how many trade routes I have available. 971! 94! What the... It's because I'm not trading with anyone, that's why. But still, that's, that's a lot of money. Um, 
Is that actually the highest one? 967. No, 971 with the Iko Iki. Right, but I value this one more because I don't want them to come and attack me. No, I don't want that. Time and order so let's see. Uh, I mean, it's going to mostly wasted. depend on who, who's willing what to pay. You want? Who's willing to pay me the most, and they're not willing to pay me much at all. Oh, because so they have war horses, of course. Your You're not willing to pay me much. Do you also have war horses? Is that something you have, Iko Iki man? Um, it certainly doesn't look like you have war horses, but fair enough. Chosukabe was not a rich one. Not as rich as the uh, Matsuda, though. Try that amount. I will listen attentively. Hmm. Oh, I already tried you. Sorry. Send a uh, another diplomat halfway across the world. What the? My friend. You still don't want to fucking trade with me, you garbage man? Uh, and Amako is definitely the worst one. I but if you're willing to pay me a bunch of money, you're about to die anyway. So. As to the will you be my vassal? No. Alright, so no one wants to pay me even a thousand. Ugh. That's pretty rough. Now I have, um, I have one, two, three trade ports, so I should be able to trade with three clans by sea. That shitty coastal village, and that's a harbor, which is also not providing any. So yeah, free trade agreements. Alright, so that's good to know. Let's start with the Auchi. I want them not to declare war on me, so if I can just... I will listen. But my heart get um, tells me that some relations building up. Be entirely helpful to our course. Plus, they're one of the richest ones in terms of how much money I'm going to get from this. It's just a shame they're not willing to pay me anything. I mean, 150 gets another trade ship, so that's good. All right, then the Ikwiki, I believe, is the next richest. Yep, all right. Uh, will you pay me at least like Cast 150? Your words upon the breeze. Did you say maybe yes to a thousand? They no. will drift past my ears. Past my ears. Alright, will you pay me 200? Ooh, 250. Whoa! 350? Whoa! 450? Oh. 400? Alright, 350 it is. I mean, it's better than 150, I suppose, and the income's still pretty good. Thanks, mate. Uh, and then the Matsuda, I believe, is the next best one. Also, tr things might change when you trade with some people. But not in this case. Sometimes travelers so, yeah, and profit by it. Shall we um, see what our journeys have I mean, in I'm store for us? Expecting them to declare war on me anytime soon. Just kind of, you know, maybe this is a very good wife. I have no idea. That's the downside. You can't see. There's no like indication of what what she's gonna do for me. Ask not what your wife can do for you, but what you can do for your wife. Uh, will you pay me the bitch Goku? Yes. Uh, how much is that though? 533. Yeah, that's definitely worth it, even if I can get a little bit of money from the other people. Speak and do not um, Yeah, bitch girl. I'll take your wife. Fuck it. March Fuck her as well. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay, that didn't change the price at all. Alright, let's see if she's any good, I guess. I've got one more trace. Traits. Uh, first, I want to see what this wife does. It. Uh, oh, it's not even like. A relevant one, is it? Because you're already married to Shoni. <laughs> you're married to the Shoni! You disgusting fucking woman! Well, get that out of my court. Oh man, she even, we have a son with her already? Ah, oh, well, never mind. Um, so yeah, the other one is either married to one of my random generals or to, like, yeah, basically it doesn't matter. Um, so it's just relations, really. But we got one more trade, so... I mean, the next one will be just Gabe, but they don't want to trade. Disgusting pricks. So I guess the Yamako, if they want to. We will. I have weapons that need polishing. I have Speak weapons quickly, that need polishing. So that I may polishing. be about something useful today. Oh man, this is going to be the highest one. The fucking Amako of all people. Wait, you said no to a fa- Oh! Did I never try a fa- Oh! I think maybe I went to 4,000 with them immediately and they said no to that. Well, I'm glad I figured out they still want to pay me something. That's good. 2,500. I'll be able to build quite a bit of shit right now. Uh, 2,750? Oh my goodness, 2900, 2850, 2800, alright fine, 2750, bastard. Alright, sounds good, um, thank you for that, and that's all the trade, alright, we're making five grand, just out, just out of fucking thin air, just, just make that appear, that shit, it's like, oh yeah, um, just as an FYI, I'm rich now. Just uh, thought you should know. Oh shit, we can build an Amand- Oh, because we already have the- Like, we, I guess we're never gonna get the Christian event. We can just build a trade port whenever we want. That's pretty cool. 
we can get more import of Matsuka Shigaru. <laughs> Other than the two I haven't actually used at all yet. Right, I really want to build this because that's more money. I also want to build every trade ship I can. I think I'm already queuing up a couple of them. Yes, I need one more here and then... Did I queue this one up? No, I didn't. I obviously have a ton of shit to build. So even though I, I'm not necessarily going to sit back forever, this is still going to be, you know, we, we have to build up our shit, so I'm still going to have to take some time doing all that. Uh, so Boozin is going to rebel. I need three units in there, because so that's going up, that's going down. How many do I need in here? Five. No, I can move out five, I mean. Um, no, I can move out six, seven. What's that culture thing from? We got plus one culture incoming, but I mean that's not Zen or something. Are we building a building that's giving us plus one? Oh right, this building gives me. Okay, well that's three turns from now, so that's not super relevant. Uh, he's in needs two units, but it's probably okay. It's gonna be mounting. Okay, if I recruit one unit here, or just put one unit in there, which I guess I'll do. So let's put the uh, one Yari Ashigaru in there, and then we can move out five units from here with no issues. Yes, let's do that. Let's take the general uh, and two, two gun units here. So that keeps everyone happy. You're going to be happy next turn. You're going to be happy in two turns. And you're still unhappy, right? So I need to get a unit over here. But we have, we happen to have an entire fucking army over here laying around, so could probably use some of that. Uh, we have not very... Oh god, this is partially Christian as well. Disgusting. Absolutely horrendous, this. Uh, you're going to be super happy anyway, though, so that's not a problem, right? So we can move out basically whatever we want. So let's take, um... I don't know. Let me super split up here. Let's just take, like, a bunch of stuff, I guess. It's going to be kind of random, but, yeah, as long as I can get in there. Yeah, that's going to be fine. All right. It's going to be kind of messy for a little bit, but that's kind of the name of the game, I think. Um, right, all the trade stuff. So we're going to feed all the trade ships from here to there, and then from here to there. So I guess all the trade ships from here are going to have to fill up these two. These are less important, so... We got six in there, two in... No, one in there. This is not a... Uh, not, not such a ship. You better not declare war on me. I'm giving you the silk. I'm giving it to you! Uh, right, any other navy stuff that I'm missing? Nope. Alright, cool. I would like to upgrade a trading port or two, so I can get more ships going ASAP. So the easiest one would indeed be here. Other than that, what would I need to do? I'd need to just... I mean, I, I have buildings everywhere to, to build, so... Um... I definitely need to recruit more units as well before I get it. Like, the Auchi might just come at me next turn. I think they're pretty busy in these because they're at war with both of the clans over here. But, um, yeah, I do need to build a bit of a force. We have got, like, we could build a full stack there, but we'd have to abandon a bunch of towns that are unhappy, so. Anyway, yeah, let's just get uh, any any trade stuff first, because, of course, that gives me an extra trade agreement as well, um, besides also being able to build more trade ships. And I would like to hold off on recruiting units as long as possible so that I make more money. But I also realize that I can't forever. Forever! Uh, anyway, I mean, that's finally it. Long turn, but there it be. Let's go. That was a very good episode, I think. Bit quickie going strong, which is a bit annoying. I wish someone would help hold them in check so I don't have to worry about stupid religion later on. It's the nice thing about starting in the West is that, you know, you can deal with Christianity pr pretty early on and then you're basically golden for the rest of the campaign, unless the Ikwiki take off, which in this case they seem to have done. No, you fucking prick! I'm finally making money! Oh. Uh, I'm, I don't like him. Okay, we didn't take any shifts, but whatever. Sun comes of age. Great. Great clan destroyed. Oh, fuck. Who's that? God, I, I think this is the campaign where I got every single one of them wrong. There's not many left, though, is there? I think there's still the Takeda, the Hojo, and the Ikuiki. And the Date? Or did they die? God, I'm gonna say Hojo, just because I can't remember who's left. And, I mean, out of the Takeda and the Hojo, it would certainly be the Hojo. We know the Ikuiki's still alive. We know that Jiskabi is still alive, so Hojo. 
Altori oh, Altori was still alive. Man, I must have guessed them a while ago. <laughs> I sir, I for sure I. Oh, and I met them last turn. I could have known they were still alive. Lost. I could have known they died. This campaign is doomed because I d I can't fucking ever get the clans right, which doesn't really matter, but still. Uh, our income dripped or dropped quite drastically. I guess we're being we're having some blockades going or something. I don't know. Either way, that's gonna be that for now. Thank you guys so much for watching. Next time we're gonna start making some some hard ass cash, I think. Until then, have a good day and goodbye.